I thought of another story to tell you. It's one of my backpacking adventures that I had with one of my husbands. And um, he and I backpacked a lot all over the Smoky Mountains. And um, we just enjoyed it immensely. But on my first backpacking trip, we went to Gregory Ball. That's a place uh, here that a lot of people hike and backpack. And we went to the part that's called 20 Mile. And we took in stakes and uh, set up our camp, our tent, and everything. And we had a big steak for supper, delicious food. Uh, and uh, so when it come time for us to go into our tent and go to bed, well, I couldn't go to sleep. But we still had a fire going outside because we wanted to keep the wild animals away. But anyway, my husband went to sleep. Well, I got to hearing a noise out around the campfire. And it was a big black bear. I want you to know that I was scared to death. I did not know what to do. I was froze. I couldn't wake up my husband. I was afraid that he would say something and the bear would attack the tent. And um, so I just laid there petrified, scared to death that that bear was going to uh, claw in through our tent and eat us alive. You know, I've seen all kinds of scary movies where stuff like that really happens and people's eating their... Oh, I could just tell that that bear was going to drag me out by my feet and eat me. But anyways, I laid there really still, just as still and quiet as I could be. And that bear turned over pots and pans that we had there cooking with. And it just went away, thank God. If it hadn't of... I don't know how much longer that I could have laid there because I was about ready to die. And I was on the, sleeping on the side where the bear was, and I wasn't about to make a sound because I knew that it would eat me alive. And my husband, knowing him, he would have run. Sorry thing, I divorced him. <laughs>